Liberty or Liberty X, whichever one you want to call them, thinking it over, especially for you, Michelle. Hope you're listening. <laughs> well, no, I hope she's not listening. I hope she's in the... Oh yeah, the house. Uh, you've got you've got a bit of history with it, haven't you? I have indeed, all of them actually. Um, oh, this is embarrassing. Go on. Um, uh, many, 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 many moons ago, uh, I lived in Gran Canaria, and then I came back uh, after being the Steps tribute band and auditioned for a TV reality TV show mm. uh, called Pop Stars. Ah, the original, the uh, original reality re- thing. Yeah, um, with Nasty Nigel and Nicky Chapman and some bloke called Paul and um, <laughs> I don't know some who he bloke. is some bloke uh, and uh, yes so I got to meet Michelle and Kelly and Jessica and of course all of Hearsay as well uh, met them and Darius and a few of the others in fact uh, we, I got quite far down yeah I was going to ask you um, how did you go yeah, out of 5,000 people, I got down to the last 60, which is 60. Right? Very good. Thank you very much. Well done. Well done. Uh, and I got kicked out for pouting, apparently. No, you pouting? Apparently so. But the thing is, it was really annoying because the the first day they had uh, um, someone teach us this, the song, and then the second day we had a different singing teacher, and he wasn't very nice. Um. And I couldn't pick up what he was teaching. And so I was going, ooh, do, 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 do. And I was like, ooing my lips and pouting. And they said I got pouting. Oh. So I got called Pouting Peter in the press and, oh. and in the magazines and on the TV and stuff, which is yeah. sad. Just think, you could have been in Liberty X. You I could know. Have, or here, so you could. Where are they now? Well, <laughs> well the blokes. Well, well, one's in uh, one's in uh, uh, Coronation Street. Is Kim, he? She was lovely, Kim. Oh no, no the, Kim blokes. What about the oh, blokes. Oh, the blokes. I don't know. I think Noel's still knocking about Wales somewhere. Is he? Yeah, uh, I don't know where Danny is. And it's, it's just a shame that everyone used to call him Shrek because he was such a nice guy. As was Noel, to be fair. Mm. They were really, really lovely. The only one that wasn't nice at the time was Mylene. Really? Ooh, she was so far up her own bottom she could see next year's really? um, excrement. Yeah. yeah that's seriously. a lovely phrase. Yeah. If you're but just tucking into your Cocoa Pops. I don't know why we eat Cocoa Pops at half past ten, but there we are. Students. Yeah. 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 Um, I mean, I'm sure she's changed now, but I mean, because I've changed from the person that I was, but she wasn't very nice then. She really mm. thought she was the bee's knees and the mutts nuts, and uh, yeah, I didn't like her. But uh, Jessica, Suzanne, uh, Kim, and myself, we were very, very naughty and all got very, very drunk. Oh, very, really? Very, very well, that story's for another time, I think. Uh, yeah, I don't, you don't even want to know what happened after I think I do. Room parties uh, galore, yeah, in Birmingham, in Edgebaston. It was, it was quite a good time. <laughs> okay, well, still to come, we've got the uh, pandemic. <laughs> Anthem. Uh, we've got white meats. Very exciting. And after this, we'll be back with Denise Williams. Darling. Let's hear it for the boy by Denise Williams. A fabulous song that reminds me of my childhood. And uh, I think it's a special song because it reminds me of my mum and dad. And Aww. I've just been back home this weekend and been treated like a little prince, so it's been awesome. Oh, <laughs> that's lovely. Pete. I know, I love my mum and dad. You're listening to Carry On Friday on GTFM 107.9, and it's now time for White Meats. Now, I believe you have a jingle for us, Pete. Is that correct? I do. Okay. So um, you've well, this song is from 1961, and I was kind of just listening to it, and I thought, oh, this could work. So hopefully people will enjoy it. So uh, give it a bit of a listen and see what you think. Okay. Brace yourself, folks. White meats, white meats. Oh, Alan, white meats, white meats. Can't you see he's not finding this a chore? Dreaming of celebrities are knocking his door. Whoa, whoa, white meats, white meats. Whoa, whoa, white meats. Meats, white meats, whoa, whoa, white meats. Hello. <laughs> that's that's very nice, Pete. <laughs> it's uh, it's a bit different. We'll have to see if it takes off like White Noise did. Well, I think uh, people can sing along. Maybe we can play it at the end of the game, and then people can sing meats, along. White meats, white meats. It's quite catchy, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Uh, no, white, white meats, white, white meats. meats. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay, okay, cool. Yeah. So the idea of the game is that I've met someone in my dreams, uh, a celebrity. They've come a knocking at my door uh, and said hello. Apparently, <laughs> uh, we're going to get a caller on this week uh, to play against you, Pete. Last week you didn't do too well. You asked questions such as, uh, are they famous and do I know them? Uh, which, frankly, <laughs> if you didn't know them, it'd be a pointless game. Uh, so why don't we meet our caller? This week's lucky contestant is Bryn Morgan. Hey! Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. And what are you up to on this Friday evening? At this very moment, I'm learning my lines. Ooh. Oh. Are you a bit of a thespian? <laughs> a thespian? Hello? I am. Oh, yeah. <laughs> thought you were so shocked there, Bryn. He, he dropped off. <laughs> <laughs> what, are you, what are you learning your lines for? Um, it's for a pantomime. I'm in next week, Aladdin. 
Ooh. Oh. I like to have a lad in on a Friday. Oh, <laughs> Where's that, Bryn? Um, it's at the Kamaman in Institute in Aberdeer. Ah, oh, cool. So people can come along and see that, yeah? Yeah, yeah. It's um, from next Monday to the Saturday. Nice. And tickets are £6 adults and £5 for concessions. Well, there you are. Look, look you've come on to play a game and you've got to plug your show. Well, I think yep. that's great. <laughs> and if anybody wants to go and see Aladdin, uh, you, there are all the details. Yeah, brilliant. Right, well, let's get back to the game. Okay. 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 okay, so you understand the rules, yeah, Bryn? I do, yeah. Okay, so let's. we're going to start with you, Bryn. You can go first. Let's play White Meats. So, Bryn, is, your opening question. Is this person a male? No. Um, is she... On television? Yes. Is she in a soap? No. Is she a presenter? Yes. Is she a presenter on ITV? No. Is she a presenter on BBC? No. Oh. oh. Is she a presenter from sports show? No. Um, is she under 30? I believe so, yes. Ooh. Ooh. Is she... English? No. <gasps> Has she just had a baby? Yes! Oh, I don't want to let him get this now. I'm Bring. going to ask a random question, because I think Pete may have it. Is she Irish? No. So, Pete, do you want to have a guess? If I ask who it yes, is? Yes, please, I do. Is it Charlotte Church? Yes! Well done, Pete. You're, oh. you're one up on our callers. Hurrah! This is the first week, and I'm so sorry that I, I, that I beat you, Bryn. <laughs> oh, you didn't tell me it was for a challenge. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, Bryn, but you're good, good playing. Good, uh, I think we went quite well. We, we, we worked well together, yeah. So, so how many questions did we get up to? Is it about... About 12. Oh, well, well done. Oh, well, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry that we beat you, but at least I, at least I beat Al uh, Alan. So hey, hey, don't good. beat me this time round. That was white noise. This time it's you against the callers. I'm, <laughs> I'm just the question mark. I'm the dream meister. <laughs> <laughs> it's all I do. <laughs> well, thanks, Bryn. Thank you for playing. Um, and I hope the play goes well. I'm sure it will. The Panto. Remember, that's in... Is it the Commandment Institute? It is, yeah. Right. So and that's from next Monday. Yeah, next Monday. So go and check out Aladdin. Cool. Okay. Uh, uh, you take care. Have a good Friday night and enjoy your weekend. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Oh, Bryn there. Well done, Pete. Oh, thank you very Charlotte much. She, she, she knocked on my door and she said, Oh, but <laughs> I want to come in. i got a baby on the go. Oh, she's just had the, well, the new baby's called Dexter Lloyd. Dexter Lloyd. Dexter Lloyd. Lloyd is the traditional name of the Henson family, apparently. And Dexter's that serial killer in the show Dexter. Yeah, and that little <laughs> that little boy from Dexter's laboratory. <laughs> you know that, that program? Yeah, I know the one. Can't do the voice, though. It was nice. I liked it. <laughs> so, uh, if you want to play White Meats... Next week, just send us an email, uh, a mail at gtfm.co.uk, saying with white meats in the uh, subject, saying I want to play. This is, and then leave us your phone number, and we'll ring you back. Or go to the Facebook group and do the same sort of thing, saying I want to play white meats. Here's my phone number. Although I appreciate you don't really want to put your phone number on Facebook, so you can send us a private message, perhaps, or absolutely, we can fine. get in contact with you. But just let us know. Absolutely. White, white meats, white meats. Oh, Alan. White meats, white meats. Can't you see he's not finding this a chore, dreaming and the celebrities are knocking his door. White meats, white meats. Whoa, whoa, white meats, white meats. Whoa, whoa, white meats, white meats. Whoa, whoa, white meats. Hello. <laughs> I like it. Do you know what? It might catch on like White Noise did. Let's hope so. Yeah. Do you fancy a song then? I do. Do you fancy... Oh, you've wanted this for weeks and weeks and weeks, months even. Who? The Last of the <gasps> Shadow Puppets. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. Age of the Understatement.